Those who knew Katia Duenas Aguilar said she was a good soldier and a faithful friend. She was found dead in Clarksville four days ago. Her friends want Clarksville police to start answering their questions. It was just like friendship at first sight. Savannah Tule could relate to her friend Katia Duenas Aguilar in a lot of ways. When they met, they were both new to Clarksville. Then they became moms around the same time. I have a son, so I can't imagine if my little boy was in the place that her little boy is. The Fort Campbell soldier is now the subject of a homicide investigation. It all began Saturday at an ambulance call to Tiny Town Road. Apparently, a friend found the 23-year-old's body in a locked bedroom in her apartment. Based on the evidence, Clarksville police determined she was killed by someone else. Her party days were over when she had her kid. So for her to have malicious intent with anybody or her to be, you know, argue with anybody, it just, it's shocking. As we near Memorial Day, her community wants more information released about how the private first officer was killed. There's a lot of speculation. And I just, I couldn't believe it because I found the news article, but it didn't have like, you know, our information. So it was kind of like, no way, you know, she was a great person, like who, who could do this to her, you know? Duenas Aguilar was from just outside Dallas, Texas. She entered the active duty army in 2018. Her son was just four years old. Her friends miss her smile already. She, she was just all in all a genuine person. I mean, if I could give one word described to her, it was genuine and loyal. In Nashville, Hannah McDonald, News Channel 5.